Hey, how's it going, Step Bros? It's Masky and Dez here, and welcome back to another Top 5 Fridays. Today, we're doing the Top 5 Consoles, of course, in our opinion, based on what we've played. Yep. And yeah, I think without further ado, why delay? Let's just get started. We'll start with you, Colin. What's your number 5 console, my number man? Number 5 would be the Nintendo Switch. Oh, interesting yeah. choice. This is, uh, you know... I feel like this is where Nintendo really started with the online, yeah, but really they did with Wii and Wii U. <laughs> Even though but, it's still uh, shit. It is still shit, but looking back at Wii U, like, and we, Wii. Don't, we, don't, we don't talk about that. We don't no, talk Wii, about Wii was better than the Wii U. <laughs> it's fun playing online for Switch. It is. And they, they, have, they have deadly games for it. Oh, yeah, because then we play, like, video games, like, religiously. Switch is one of them highlight ones. You got like, Mario Kart 8 online. Like, which is, like, always fun. Like, yeah, exactly. I don't care if it's the same courses over and over again. We always have fun with that shit. Man, like, when do they get released new courses? That's what I want to know. That's what I care about, too. Like, I'm just happy to get anything at this point. Like, I don't care if you fucking give me eight of the same course. Actually, I do. Please don't. Nint oh, my God, Nintendo. <laughs> Please don't make, like, like that be one of them. Like, just a troll. <laughs> it's just I don't know. I just, Switch is, like, I, I like Switch. It's honestly one of my favorite Nintendo consoles right now. Yeah, no, I I can't I can't disagree that the Switch is a great. Like, I know I know I know you don't like playing handheld, but I like playing handheld a lot. I mean, yeah, I don't care. I I like that there's handhelds where I don't care about playing on handheld myself. But I mean, I like the Switch. It's a good console. Can't disagree with you there. I can see why you have it have it up there. I didn't expect it at number five, to be honest. But I can see oh, why. Oh really? Yeah, no, I did not expect that in your top five, to be honest. Yeah, yeah, that, I love it. Good choice. Good choice. So um, it's yours. My number five. We have. The good old Super Nintendo. Well, number five. Oh, okay. Yeah. What do you expect? I was expecting to be like number like top three at least. Mm -mm -mm, boy. <laughs> remember, Super Nintendo was very was a was very prominent in my early years of gaming, but I oh, shit, probably yeah. had him. But like I said, it was like grade three when my mom dropped my fucking Super Nintendo. Since <sighs> we're talking about it, did I tell the, we've told the story one thing once playing a horror game, but no one fucking watched that video, so we might as well tell it here again where people actually might hear it. So I used to have a Super Nintendo probably up until I was like eight years old, yeah, seven or eight, something like that. And my mom actually knocked it off the shelf, probably because, like an asshole, I had my wires dangling. So, you know, not her fault she dropped it. So I went to go turn it on, and it didn't turn on. My mom told me. I was like, oh, dang. And, yeah, so she went and got rid of the Super Nintendo to this place called Take It or Leave It. Yep. What you do at Take It or Leave It, you just drop shit off, and that's it. That's that. It's done and over with. You're free to take whatever you want. Leave it there. Take it. Whatever the fuck. Who cares? But she also took all 30 fucking games. There it is, yeah. So, and it's, and uh, just my luck, one of my classmates in, in the third grade happened to ha pick, be the one that picked it up. That that was That's such a steal for every, whoever got those games. Yep. And that's such a mom move. Like, what are you like doing, mom? That is mom to the central, right? <laughs> and to this day, I still bug my mom about it. Like, not in a fucking harsh way, but it's one of those things like, hey, yeah. ma. Yeah, remember, remember my games? Just go flip just out. Push, push you into the wall. <laughs> <laughs> fucking games, bitch! <laughs> Christ. <laughs> it sucks, buddy. What can you do? But yeah, that's my number five. Jesus. So I think let's move on to number four. Uh, Dejanator. What you got there? All right, after just shitting on it, but Nintendo Wii. The Wii or the Wii U? The Wii? The Wii. Nice, good choice. Uh, this is where they in introduced the um, the Wii motion. Yep. The Wii, I can't, what I like about the Wii is that it had backwards compatibility with the GameCube, mm -hmm. and as someone yep. who didn't grow up with GameCube, I was able to play all those good games when I when I got my Wii, so I really appreciated the Wii for that. It was Hell like, yeah. fuck yeah, this is the shit. Even though I still want a GameCube just for my collection, the Wii U was the Wii was like I love the Wii for being pretty much two consoles in one in that regard. Man, I remember first I remember first getting it. Like I was so amazed how like what you can do like pointing to the screen like oh fuck yeah man. I don't know like it was it was awesome. It playing, was like playing a whole Wii Sports. World. Playing yeah. Wii Sports was so fun. Mhm. Mm and yeah, I, remember, I, remember, I remember I played the shit out of that one summer. Like I played every day. Me too. I remember one time doing boxing, thinking I was the shit. I feel like, <laughs> and, and, then, and then Matt comes in and rocks my shit. Ah, oh, fucking Matt. Yeah, I got the pro. You know, fuck you, Matt. You piece of shit. Couldn't beat the masky. Or as he called himself back then, Psycho K. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, yeah, yeah, Wee's, Wee's up there for sure. The Wii is a the Wii is a classic. Even though now I'm like, it, I don't really care for it, but 
well, it's I mean, it has to be up there just for like how much it amazed me when we first got it. I mean, for its time, it's despite the fact that it fucking lacked HD oh, and widescreen, exactly, it was still pretty advanced in other ways that other yeah. consoles weren't at the time. So you gotta hand it to the Wii. Like, they, yeah, they say like, like PlayStation they, tried to do it, like they tried to the do their own and just it didn't work. Shit. Connect and then Xbox had Connect, which was fucking impossible to use. Yeah. Like everyone just followed after Nintendo did it with the Wii. So exactly. Nintendo they pioneered something there. Hardcore. But Nintendo mastered it, then they just couldn't do it. Yeah, actually, I'm shocked that Nintendo was out of all things Nintendo couldn't do. Motion control is the one they actually got. Yep. Like who would have thought? Actually, like to this day, they still kind of have the fucking like. Oh yeah, they they, they have it down. Which yeah, I can't believe like I'll which is, which is, like people don't really use like I'm not, I'm kind of sick of it nowadays. I get but... why people don't like it, but for those that do enjoy it and want like a motion control game, like a dance game or a fucking sports game, you gotta hand it to to Nintendo. They they know how to do their motion controls. Yeah, yeah. So that's right. my number four. Uh, so my number four is the PlayStation Portable. Oh shit! Yeah, that, I played the shit out of that growing up. You know. Final Fantasy 1 on the PSP, Final Fantasy 4 on the PSP, Vice City, Liberty City Man, Stories. Vice City Stories, that was my shit. Yep, Vice City Stories, Liberty City Stories. So much fucking fun, man. The PSP rocked, man. I used to rock that shit at school. Everyone had DSs. I had a fucking PSP, man. You thought you were just badass. Like, yeah, oh <laughs> look at this over here. I felt so out because I couldn't play anything I don't everyone else was playing. <laughs> but then I realized I didn't give a shit about Pokemon or anything like that anyways. Because exactly. I was playing my fucking Final Fantasy games, man. Yeah, PSP. yeah, man. Like, I wish I got more games for that, but I just like I got into it probably too late. <laughs> yeah, it was too late. I mean, emulators and shit nowadays. Not that anyone would ever do that because that doesn't <laughs> exist. But I know we never did that. Jesus, we've never ever played emulators. We only play real. We're in the same <laughs> room right now together. Actually, we don't even yeah. know what online computer. Yeah, what you, you can hear us kiss. See. So at number three, what do you got, Colin? <laughs> I have, uh... <laughs> but yeah, the PSP, man. Classic, in my opinion. Anyways, yeah, number three. Number three. <laughs> I have the SNES. Alright, solid, solid, solid. Uh, yeah. I played this shit a lot as uh, in my... <laughs> when I was a child. Jesus Christ, I can't even talk. In my childhood? I mean... <laughs> <laughs> because of that. I know, but I kind of stumbled. I mean, what's cool about you is that you're still, like, I haven't really gone out and explored Super Nintendo much as an adult. You, But you seem to be still doing it, like, finding brand new Super Nintendo games yeah. to play that you never played. It's, it's, I, it's all my brother. Like, he finds games and I play them like, shit, this Yeah, this because, game, yeah, game he success. actually collects them, right? I yeah, yeah, saying that before. Yeah. So, yeah, you have, so it gives you more incentive. Like, fuck yeah, I haven't seen this game in ages. Let's play it. Yeah, exactly. Like, yeah. I, found, I found so much games that my brother used to play and then I played them. Yeah, like didn't and you I'm play like, like, yeah, Goof Troop is one of them. Goof right? Troop is one of them. Uh, mm -hmm. That was well, Zelda, one of them. Like, yeah. and there's a lot. Yeah, I mean, except for Mario Kart, I I hate. I don't care for that one. I know you don't like that one. It's not that good com in comparison nowadays. But at, at the time, man, when I I mean, it's fun ship, playing for multiplayer. But man, I just like, don't. Back I, the, guys don't play it alone. Let me tell you though, man. Back in the day, it was the shit. <laughs> <laughs> I bet. Mm -hmm. But I just I just couldn't get into it. No, that's understandable, especially compared to nowadays, Mark. Like honestly, eight has the best driving. Fight me. Oh on yeah, that. for sure. Fight me on that comments. Eight is the best driving. <laughs> I'm sure no one wants to fight you. I'm sure they're agreeing. But if no, you don't, if you, you have, don't you agree, have, then... you have your Mario Kart Wii narcs that will defend that, <laughs> no matter what. Man, you are just on like they're tripping. That's all I'm saying. They're tripping, dog. But this ain't about Mario Kart. This is about our consoles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. And we're. Yeah. Uh, I, was, I was about to go off there. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, SNES number three. Oh, rap, like 30 minute rap. <laughs> so, uh, what's yours? Uh, my number three is the PlayStation 2. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yep. I was expecting that. Yep, that after my Super Nintendo got fucked up, I went, my dad, well, my dad had a PS2, and mm. he got me a PS2 Slim. And after the Super Nintendo broke, that was pretty much all I played besides the PSP, and. Up until I got my Wii when I was 11. Oh, shit. Yeah, so let me tell you, man. I have probably like 60, 70 plus PS2 games, which may not be a lot to some but to some people, but like as a kid growing up, that's a lot of fucking that's actually games a played, lot. man. <laughs> that's so like, much. And not every game, let me tell you, not every game on there is a fucking hitter. We got some, some uh, what you call, 
dog on there, like oh, uh, yeah. Super Trucks Racing. <laughs> you know, that's a classic. <laughs> uh, what, a, what a name. Deer Hunter. Is that an that's, arcade? I don't know, man. Do you look up Deer Hunter for PS2 at some time? You'll see it might not be what you're thinking of. Because this one isn't just like a straight, like you just shoot with a thing. It's you got to travel around and hunt. Oh. This is some, yeah, you're probably not thinking of what you're, what I'm thinking of. Oh, I'm thinking of like Big Buck Hunt, I think. Maybe something like that. But, you know, it did have its gems, man. Like the Final Fantasy X game. Fucking. Fucking <laughs> 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 uh, you had, you know, GT, the GTA games, GTA 3, San Andreas, uh, b- b- what is it, Liberty City, yeah, Vice City. Yeah, well, it's like so many fucking classics, man. Um, you had, I remember another game, I think it was just, what was it called, man? Uh, it was Robin Hood Defender of the Crown I played, you know. That game is such a meme that I love it to death. I've never it's a that. fucking classic in, in its, own, its own right, man. Like it's, you're never gonna see it up there, and like with anybody's top fives for like well polished, well made, <laughs> fucking this and that games. But let me. I remember tell you, you talking from, about that game though. Yeah, for me, more the games. Robin Hood: Defender of the Crown's up there, and yeah, like I said, the PS2 just holds a lot of fucking fond memories for me. Playing games with my little brother, Katario games, shit like that, you know. Yeah. I'm gonna say, give, man. Giving I've, your I, giving your brother the shitty guitar. Not even giving the shitty guitar, making him lower a, a, a battle against a computer, <laughs> and then <laughs> not playing and him playing, and then him dropping the controller, realizing the notes are still going. Like what the? What's going on? Again, really, him catching on the fact Shit. that he's never been playing this whole time. <laughs> Bad. <laughs> That's funny. Somehow he never caught on that we would play the same three fucking songs every time, but you know, he was like three, so I couldn't exactly blame him. Yeah. A three or four, but when he caught on to the, but he he's he smart enough to catch on that. Wait a minute, I'm not touching anything, and it's still working. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but that's my number three. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What about your number two, my man? Number two would be Nintendo 64. I saw that coming. Yeah. You're a huge narc for that. Mm-hmm. Man. Yeah. Now I this could- shit was where like, uh, I still wasn't able to like play right. Like I would like. Didn't know what I was doing, <laughs> but I played a lot of it still. I don't know why. Yeah. You and know. Uh, let me tell you, I was a little asshole on this. Yeah. How so? I would uh, I would erase my brother's files. <laughs> Holy fuck! You know what? I did that to my dad on the PS2. Granted, I did not know what I was doing because the game the games had icons, so I was clicking on it to think I could play it, but I just hit delete. But it's game. I. Just, but man. you were probably going to the games and being like, Haha, "I'm so funny." <laughs> <laughs> no, that's what I mean. They say like I didn't know, but I swear, like I did it so many times. Like I have to, I have to know what I was doing. I don't Maybe know. you kept thinking you were loading up the games. <laughs> yeah, you just erased. Like, like I erased so many games too, like Smash Bros, Mario Golf, Mario Tennis. I think like, your brothers probably came home and just fucking beat the shit. <laughs> Christ, <every day. laughs> comes home and my brain get rattled. After school, they just go through the doors of smacking you. They already know you deleted <laughs> For something. no reason. <laughs> they see a game hooked up there. Yeah, he did it. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, 64 was... Uh, as soon as I kind of started getting into gaming, I knew what kind of what, what I was doing, kind of. Yeah, I know. I, I feel that. To be yeah. honest, I never really got in the N64. Man, I love it. I did have a few games growing up, but it just wasn't my thing. Mario Still, 64, that was, that was my shit. That's my shit back then. Hey, you know, that's what you have. You know, I was running into walls and shit, but, you know. Do you think if you, get, if you tried getting into it nowadays, you'd be into it? What's that? Like, if you never played the N64 before, if you tried getting into it now, do you think? Man, like, hmm. Because, like, looking at it pro- from a... Th- pro- probably, like, pro- probably <laughs> not, because uh, I can't get into PS1 games. Oh, I can't either. Yeah. So it's definitely, you definitely could, that's what the thing is, a lot of this shit definitely is nostalgia goggles. Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> like I said, PS2 is number three for like, me. Like but someone can say, like, "Oh my games. god, that game looks so ass," and I'm like, "The hell are you talking about?" Right? But then they'll load up Final Fantasy VII, and be like, "Man, like, this game's awesome." This game I'm is like, ass. "What the fuck are you talking about? This shit looks stupid. This looks like doo doo." Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, yeah. It's but then, mo- for sure. mar- but then, fucking, I'll load up like a PS2 game that lo- I'll load up Robin Hood on PS2, and people are like, "Dude, what the fuck are you playing?" I'm like, "The fucking greatest shit in the world, man." <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Shit. 
Yeah, yeah, it's the way it is. Just like <laughs> it's yeah. shit to so much people, but to you, it's just just a Not masterpiece. Exactly. Well, that's the thing. Back in the day, that shit was technical, techno, technical, technologically advanced. Yeah, like the N sixty four was sure. groundbreaking, man. Sixty four and PS one, those are like uh, that shit was like some that was some new shit that has never been seen before. Yeah, for sure. So what can you say, man? Like, you have to give them. We have to give them credit where it, where, where it is, right? Exactly. Like it could for what for what it could have been at the at this time could have been way fucking worse. Holy shit, big like, time! You said graphically, it may not have been the best, but like you know, they for it, for the time, it was not bad. Yeah, but there's some games I just couldn't handle it. I can't. I, like, like, I can't stand Goldeneye. Yeah, Goldeneye didn't age well. <laughs> And pe sorry. people will fight me on that for sure, but... I'm sorry, people. Come on, like, get real. The, mu the music's kick-ass, <laughs> oh, but my fuck. God. The music, like, that's the thing. Like, old D-game music always ages well. Oh, yeah. But come on. <laughs> <laughs> like, just look at it. <laughs> no, please! Fuck them. <laughs> Much less look at it. <laughs> oh, my, my, bro my brother's gonna hate me for that one. Hey, man. Like I said... Robin Hood. What, what else can I say? <laughs> like I said, I can't even judge. All right. I guess we get to my number two. You're gonna be surprised by this one because I got into this one late. Xbox 360. Mmm. Why? Because I'm a fucking achievement whore. Once I start, because I used to when I, I would get platinums on PlayStation 3, but when I start getting achievements, seeing that number beside it, man. It was mm. like, this is something different. And ever since then, I haven't stopped achievements. I'm not like, I don't have millions of gamer score. Man, you have so much, thousands. I have, I have like 85,000, which isn't a lot to some other achievement hunters, but I mean, let me tell you, man, I played some fucking games. Yeah. <laughs> I played some real fucking games, man. Yeah, you played some games just to get achievements, right? It's random and ass games. Not everyone is a gem, let me tell you that. Any <laughs> achievement hunter knows that. But for what it's worth, Xbox 360 also had its fucking classics like oh, yeah. and like I said I, you playing with you and Wid just yeah. fucking it was always fun man like you think you I'd have Xbox One here right in this in this spot but I, I just have to give it 360 just yeah, cause like sure. it just it was that high of like when I was getting those achievements like I still do it but it's not the same yeah but like I remember doing that just that rush is like holy oh, seen oh my god I got that like advanced warfare I just sitting there with sweaty balls I remember just yeah, like... man oh, I fucking remember the first time I went online and like actually like got help with achievements on like a forum on xboxachievements.com it was from Monopoly Streets oh really yeah but I a thousand that thanks to the help of some guy I can't even fucking remember his name cause it was like 2014 but yeah it was a great experience and yeah like I said just that was an experience for me that was like no other just seeing that gamer score go up yeah and I always treasure that so I think we should get into our honorable mentions then how do you feel about that Coley Woley <laughs> I forgot about honor mentions. Not gonna lie. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, yeah I, I got one. I got one. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'll I'll give it to PSP. Really? Yeah. Are you sure? Positive? Like anything else you've played more religiously that you can give it to? Maybe. I was thinking I was thinking the DS, but now I gotta give it to PSP. Really? Not? I think. Are you sure not the DS? Because I think you would have loved that. That you like that way more than the PSP. I don't know. Like. <sighs> Cause PSP, you're able, you're able to have music and shit, and I always listen to music on there. Oh, okay, you're able to watch okay. movies and stuff. Yeah, movies. I don't know. Did you didn't have movies for PSP? So I had movies. Did you? Yeah. What kind? You know. I ain't, I ain't talking about pornos here either. Like I said, movies. <laughs> You give me the PSP. That's your final. That's your. Final. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, right, man. You know, fair enough. Fair enough. I remember putting music on there at uh, had, at I, freaking Wits House. See, I could have given. A, see, like that's why I considered the PS3 because I had music on there. Like I remember playing NHL and fucking in my room by ICP starts playing when I loaded. Yeah, exactly. That, that was deadly. <laughs> I remember like, that. And so, like, like I said, I don't even have PS3 on my list here. I'll not to spoil it, but like that's something I forgot about. But like, yeah, you know, is what it is, right? PlayStation yeah. had it going on for that shit. Oh yeah, they did. But the old Xbox, I can't be fair, original Xbox did have that. Yeah, but I they abandoned see, that. Yeah. yeah, for sure. So PSP, eh? Yeah. Damn. Okay. I see ya. All right. Well, I guess for my honorable mention, we'll go with the uh, Xbox One. Oh, okay. 
it's, not, it's just not a console I think of like exactly. with that same like nostalgia and feeling, right? Achievements, just, like, achievements were so much better on 360. Oh yeah, like it's easier now, which is great. But just like it's again, it's easier. Than, but like I, I like the Xbox One. I love the Xbox One because they say like it would like I said, it's probably my. It's like it's honorable mention, so it's like my number six. Did 360 do the the secret achievements as well? Or Xbox yeah, oh yeah, no, that was always that. a thing. That was always oh, a thing. Okay. And then, like I said, the PlayStation 3 followed with trophies. That's why yeah. PS3 didn't quite make it up on the list for me. Yeah. But, like I said, Xbox, yeah, Xbox One, like I said, I play, we play religiously. And mm -hmm. just, it is fun to play. Good games. Just, it's oh, not, yeah. there's nothing, there's no, like, warm feeling to it. You know what I mean? Just, yeah. It's just the console. And, uh, yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Let's get to our numero unos. All right. I, I was going to hop, like, hop, like, in this one with you, but uh, it's 360 for me. Mm -hmm. I get me. Like I said, you that was your shit growing up. Mm -hmm. Man, it's I know first that. first out of PS3. Me and me and uh, Will were playing that a lot. Yeah, I was. And then yeah, he, he told me to get 360. I'm like, oh, man, I don't want to start paying for online. <laughs> yeah, you know what fucking sucks, man? I got a PS3 because William told me to get a fucking PS3, and then he immediately <laughs> gets a like a month later gets a fucking Xbox. And I'm like, are you fucking kidding me, man? He's like, I'm sorry, dude, but I'm like, I would have, I would have gotten Xbox if you fucking said something, like, asshole. Shit, man, but holy shit, when I switched to Xbox 360, it was the best thing ever. I'm not even kidding. Like, the just the yeah, way the man. menu is, the menu is so cool. That's what it was like, like when I finally got a PS. Although, 360 although like, in the party, the party chat audio did not. Uh... It's better than the PS3s, though. <laughs> it is, but oh my PS3 god, PS3 was it's a ass. nightmare. <laughs> Xbox 360 party chat was so ass now. Looking back on it, oh yeah. But it's fun going back to it because like it's again it's like it's more. What did we have though me. that was better? Exactly. Oh, you're talking WeChat or whatever <laughs> the fuck they had back then. Christ. But yeah, um, Black Ops Two days, holy shit, yeah, and Minecraft uh, days. See, like I didn't have that with you guys. We still play. We still play Minecraft, but man, nothing. It will not beat what we had like. Oh yeah. Back then, I missed the days of Black Ops Two. Like I had it on PS Two with my friend Seth. Like, yeah, I don't even think we we were talking back then, right? No, we barely, 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 very barely. Yeah. yeah. We just. I think we just started. It was like 2013, yeah, I think, yeah, right? That, that text, yeah. Huh? It was 2013. Well, that was 2012. <laughs> But we, you and I actually started talking as friends when you found yeah. me on YouTube when it was like, it was like it was 2013. Yeah, I probably wasn't much of a douche then. No, we were we were cool. I, we, I don't think we even thought about without a text until later. We're like, hey, remember this? <laughs> I think that's really what it was. We I just, know, I remembered it, but I just didn't want to bring it up. <laughs> eh, whatever. <laughs> Jesus. But anyways, yeah. Um, Xbox, man. man. It just, it. I can't. I, I just, I won't forget those days. I really won't. Those are those are like honestly the best gaming days. Like just <laughs> we we'd get on like we honestly we'd stay on to like six or seven a.m. <laughs> every every day every night the, during the summer. <laughs> Man, that, that was some nerd shit right there. But holy hell, it was fun. <laughs> just doing nothing but gaming all exactly. fucking day. I remember it. And, like I had like a little like I I slept in a porch. What? Yeah, like we had like a little porch, and like, that's where that's where I had my setup there. So you just sleep in there and then wake up play I, games. It, yeah, I, I slept on a couch there. <laughs> Fuck, yeah, sweet, that's sick. Yeah, I had a couch and the TV, and that's where I slept. And man, holy shit, I, it was the best. Okay, it was the best. That's all I'm I mean, saying. Fuck, huh? that sounds deadly, man. Just freaking take me back there. Ugh, don't even get me started, man. <laughs> don't even get me fucking started. All right. <laughs> Well, Gears, one yep. shit off. My number one, we got, believe it or not, the Wii U. Yeah. Is, is that a joke? No, the Wii U is legit. Oh, shit. <laughs> My okay. number one console. Wow, I was not expecting that. No, and here's why. Okay. Because I, you think, because when I got the Wii, right, in 2011, I fucking love that bad boy, right? Mm -hmm. The thing is, like, I could have put it on this list because GameCube games, but I don't have as much nostalgia with GameCube games as Wii games. But when the Wii U came out and all that shit was backwards combat compatible, it was like, let me tell you, man, the Wii U was my fucking god. Because, <laughs> like, I could play a lot of games on there, too. That you yeah, could, Wii I had U Black had Ops a 2, lot of games. I had, it was Zombie, Zombie U. I had all my Mario games I loved playing. I had sports games on there that I played. And I, I can't tell you enough, so, man, I really liked how the graphics looked on it because it did look pretty nice. On what? what game? On the Wii U. 
oh, yeah, graphics yeah. in general. And I just don't know what to say, man. Like I loved, I had all the Nintendo games and shit. I loved again. It reminded me of like the Super Nintendo days again. It just brought me back to having all these games. And oh, okay, I have yeah, to give I, it to I, number yeah, one. It just it brought back then. that, like I said, yeah. that Nintendo feeling from back in the day. Like I, ha- it started with Sparking again with the Wii, but the Wii U really did it because it just had all that shit. Man. You had virtual like, games downloaded, right? For, uh, yeah, I had the virtual man, games. they had so much. Yep. So I had, I had the virtual game because from the Wii menu and stuff on the Wii U. Then I just the Wii U games themselves and all the Wii games. It was like this was like the perfect console for me, for me. Mm-hmm. And all the Mario games, like Mario 3D World, like. Come on, that yeah. shit's the fucking jam, man. <laughs> that is fun. Then you had, you know, of course, can go through the Wii games. I was able to play Mario Galaxy One and Two. Oh, some fucking classics there. I love Mario Galaxy, man. Yeah, like that is my shit. I remember playing NHL Eleven, and it was so fucking garbage, but I played the <laughs> shit out of it. Like you had characters that would fucking like walk out backwards. They didn't even pronounce Devin Dubnik right. They pronounced it Dubnik. Dubnik. Yeah, and for some reason, well, I don't know if it was mine was glitched, but he was like 6'11". <laughs> so I think mine was glitched, but he was like a fucking giant walking on the ice, man. <laughs> like, swear you fucking, he bumps his head on the fucking, what's it called, the Jumbotron. <laughs> but yeah. But yeah, like I said, I, I have, have, you, played, like, the have you played Nintendo Land? Yep, Nintendo Land hit the spot man, again. That, that shit was so much man, fun. Man, I'm so, like, that was such a fun game. Plus, another thing with the Wii U, man, like... When I did my first YouTube co-op channel, The Sore Loser Gamers, with my friend Seth, yeah, Wii U was like one of the biggest things to go to for all those reasons. Yeah, you guys and played a lot of Wii U games, eh? Yep, a lot of Nintendo shit, and the Wii U was a big part of all of that. Mm-hmm. So, like I said, it's just so many memories, so many great memories of the Wii U that are not like too early, but not too late either. From the B fucking like very nostalgic to me. Yeah. I have to give it to the Wii U, man. Yeah, I have to. It's it's the black sheep for sure, but what can I say? Make makes uh makes sense. Makes yeah. sense. Yeah, and hey, it makes for an interesting list, right? You know, it really, I, man, I was not expecting Wii U. Yeah, I really wasn't. No, like I said, when I was thinking, about it, I was like, you know, honestly, this might be the shit. No one's gonna fucking nobody's gonna have this at number one. But what can I say? Yeah. Mm-hmm. We well, there you have it, folks. Cool. cool. <laughs> What? Curveball there. <laughs> that was a goofball. <laughs> Shit, man. Anyways, you sure threw a curveball there. Yeah, what can you say? Keep things interesting, you know. Yeah. But yeah, that's our that's our top five consoles for top five Fridays. What do you guys think of our list? Do you agree? I'm sure you fucking don't with a lot of the shit. Do you disagree? Probably. Leave a comment below, and we'll be more than happy to talk about it civilly. Yeah, we'll talk about it. Yeah. Bitches. And... <laughs> anything else you want to add, Dejanator? Uh, don't do... Don't do drugs. Yeah. Unless it's really good math. Bye! <laughs> <laughs>